In fact, I learned about focus uh, a long time ago, and I learned about the power of hypnosis. Didn't even call it hypnosis, but I learned it in the sport of amateur wrestling. How many of you are familiar with WWF or WWE? Okay, it has nothing to do with that sport that I was in. The sport I was in was in the Olympics. It's what you'd see uh, Greco-Roman freestyle, and it's a very uh, tough sport, mentally and physically. And when I was in grade 10, I wrestled out one of the best clubs in Canada, in Sherwood Park, Alberta. It was called the Salisbury Wrestling Club. And my coach, Glenn Perch, he asked me, he says, Wayne, how well do you want to do this year? And I said, I want to do real well. He says, no, but specifically, how well do you want to do? And it just came out of me. I said, I want to make it into the finals of the Canadian National Championships. He said, fantastic. Great goal, Wayne. He said, here's what you have to do. Perfect. He laid out the regimen. I had all the great trainers, the coach. And there was a mantra, an affirmation that started to come through my mind. And it went like this. I'm going to make it into the finals. I'm going to make it into the finals. And I just started to say it every day. I would see the picture of myself in the final wrestling. I would feel it in my body. And so we wrestled that whole year, lots of tournaments. And I got to tell you, just like public speaking for some of you, uh, wrestling was so very, very nerve wracking for me. I would go up against op opponents and I'd feel very nervous. But I had that saying and that saying would bring some confidence. And that saying was, I'm going to make it into the finals. I'm going to make it into the finals. So finally, we make it to the national championships and I wrestle my first match, I win my match, and I felt ecstatic. The next two, I won those matches. The next match, if I win that match, I would make it into the finals and I would achieve my goal. Following along? So, the person that I was wrestling was much more experienced and a lot stronger. But what was I saying? I'm going to make it into the finals. I'm going to make it into the finals. So I get into my stance. It's a five-minute match. We go back and forth for five minutes. Whistle blows. It's a three-all tie. I get a minute with my coach before sudden death overtime. And to this day, I have no idea what my coach said to me. Because all I'm thinking is, I'm going to make it into the finals. I'm going to make it into the finals. I was in a trance-like state. Didn't even realize that's what hypnosis is. So I get back on the mat, ready to wrestle. Whistle blows. We go out of bounds, off the mat. I race back into the center of the mat, get into my stance. The ref grabs my hand or my wrist raises my arm. Yes! I got the point out of bounds, don't even know how I did it. I achieved my goal. I was ecstatic. The next day I'm going for the gold medal. And guess what? I lost. Now here's the punchline. The person that I lost to in the finals, that person lost to the person that I beat to get into the finals. And I said to my coach, I said, I felt robbed. I could have won that match. I said, what, what happened? He said, Wayne, what did you focus upon all year long? Getting into the finals. He said, you need to fix your focus. I mean, what do you mean fix my focus? You focused upon getting into the finals, but you didn't focus in on the gold. And that was a powerful learning lesson for me because I was thinking to myself, wow, the power of our focus to create a reality, to create a result, and that's the foundation of all performance and behavior. Either it propels us forward or it paralyzes us. So my question, and you have that orange card, and I'm not going to get you to do any writing in here right now, but when you do write this down, it will ingrain in your body and your subconscious, which is your GPS, your great programmable subconscious, and magic does happen. You will see the people, places, things, events, opportunities start to come to you as if I am magic, but that magic is really who you are, because you have set the first part to program your GPS, setting a goal. So my question is this, what is your gold medal? What is your gold medal?